much. No, why? See, and he's trying to see if, but he shouldn't be doing this. Don't compare her to that other girl. We already know that other girl is haggard. Just move on with her and just realize that she was just not a good person. Like, now he's going to be trying to find out what's wrong with me. Like, oh, I couldn't, uh, she said I could, wouldn't stop blinking. Like, who gives a fuck what that bitch says? She's gone. She's not even, and she's nothing anymore. Like, just stop talking about her. And looking away? No. Just, and I think I tend to kind of, like, look around. I tend to, like, maintain a really strong eye contact. What was the first thing, was the first thing I ran said to her? That you maintain too much eye contact. Like, you don't blink very much. <laughs> like, fuck you. <laughs> No, she's not, she's a real woman because she laughed at that guys. I told you though. At first, I told you Irina is a better match for him. The only concern with Irina is that she dated the bad boys and she uh, admitted it to us openly. That was my concern with Irina. Everything else, like she's good looking, she's nice, she's sweet, she's uh, considerate, she listens, she's feminine, like, she has nice hair, skin. She's the, a great girl, you know what I mean? Irina, all she had was nice tits. That's it. Like, let's be honest. Like, she didn't have a good personality. She was fat. She was a bitch. She was abrasive. She laughed too much. She's always, she's never serious. She's fucking clout chasing. Like, literally, the list goes on of bad qualities with Irina. It's like, I don't know, understand why he picked her. It's like, it just really makes you question this guy. Like, where's your mind? How could you not see that? Especially with her saying that she had two failed marriages already. It's like, bro, that should have already just told you what you need to know. Being a lawyer, too. It's like, what are we doing here?